Well, it's Christmas card season and I love seeing all the photos of family and friends and we actually just got some photos done for this a couple of weeks ago. I have to show Baylor when I can, right? Well, this got me thinking, when was the last time that you had professional photos taken of you or your family? We took some professional headshots about three years we'll ago. So we, can see um, we usually get them done every five years or so as a family. So we took some about three years ago and then I had some personal like headshots done last year. Professional, okay. like professional, yeah. Mm -hmm. We haven't done that in years. And really? Because we, we, we just literally get one of our neighbors because I mean, cell phones take pretty good pictures. So they'll take the picture with a decent phone and then I'll do some filters and doctor hmm. it up a little bit. Yeah, a lot of people are doing that this, these days. Yeah, I hadn't really had anything done professionally in a while until obviously I had Baylor and now I want to get them done all the time. But <laughs> I asked the same question on my Instagram and here's what some of you said. WFMY's Jenna Krasina says this past spring, Kara's baby actually had one year photos done yesterday. Chandler says she and her boyfriend Nick got some done last April. It was 20 years ago for Linda. Audra did in August. Riley did in November. And Jill writes when my son was born four years ago. And then Kimmy said she got hers done four months ago for her engagement photos. Now, most people that responded said that they had gotten photos done in the last year. Photographers are calling it the photography boom between booking for weddings and family sessions. Randolph County photographer Samantha Brooks says it's been a wild couple of years. Even though she stayed busy in 2020 with elopements and small backyard weddings, this year she's doubled the number of weddings. Plus, she's almost fully booked for 2022 with only three spots open. So the wedding boom is essentially everyone press pause on planning in 2020 and then they all hit play at once. It's a good time to be in the wedding industry. But she's also seen a huge increase in family and newborn sessions this year. I think with the social media craze that we have for our generation, people just want professional photos to post because I can see what is downloaded and usually it's the um, web page size photos that are downloaded, not the print size. So I know they're only posting, they're not printing. And she says if you're interested in photography, now is the time to try it out. But I thought that that was so interesting what she says that people, it's true in my life too, I want to get professional photos mm -hmm. done so I can post on social mm -hmm. media. And she also said that 80% of her business comes from Instagram. Wow. People finding her on there. They could probably tag her in the post and then they're like, that's a great photo. Let me go check yeah. her out. Yeah, she has 43,000 followers. Now. Wow. Oh OK, I need to get her contact information. Yeah, she's, I mean, she's fantastic. Yeah, these pictures are beautiful. <laughs> I was so I was rethinking this. The last time we did have a photography session was when Tyler was a newborn. So that was 11 years ago. Mm -hmm. um, so, yeah, that's the last time we did it. But I think that I like them because I like to create a gallery wall at home mm -hmm. with yes. kids' yeah. pictures from all over. So yeah. I like the printouts as well. Just you can frame them. You can send them to family and relatives. It's nice to have it online too, but it just says something different when you go home and see those pictures, you know, in person. Yeah, and I mean, it's so special to look at those photos years down the road. Like mm -hmm. I am very appreciative of the photo albums that my parents have and mm -hmm. I needed to be better about uh, printing photos out. Mm -hmm. I tell you, it's very important once you have little ones to keep those pictures yes. for years and years. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. very cool. They're all on our phones.